Good greetings, one and all. Oft Mamer here, Quartermaster, MHS Hysteria. So, last week, the Captain and Lily deployed their giant robot uh, to go fight the Kraken in Watch City. They said that the robot won, and that the Kraken was out of commission. But, big surprise, the squid came back. It came back very much alive, and beat the bolts out of the robot. Now, normally, I don't like saying I told you so. Yes, you do. But, I knew that thing wasn't dead. Krakens don't go down that easily, and I should know. The year was 1974. And I was canoodling around a small East Coast Island town looking for adventure and some hot fun in the summertime. And there was something odd about this town. I had noticed that many of the residents were mysteriously disappearing. At first, the townspeople were content to blame the disappearances on almost anything else. Drownings, accidents, alien abduction. But I knew better. I mean... Those crafty little beady-eyed green-skinned bastards, they, it's just not their style. No, this was a beast, the likes of which had not been seen in these waters for a millennia. First to disappear was a, a hippie girl down by the beach. Nobody really seemed to care about that one. But the next one was a dog. I mean a dog! So, I knew I had to do something. After a little ribbing by me, I finally got the townspeople fired up to go out and hunt the monster! It was uh, either hunt the monster, keep the beaches open, and keep all of their businesses on a paying basis, or be on welfare all winter. Townspeople stormed the beaches, like a buffet dinner after a spin class. And a couple of local yokels actually pulled in an 18-foot infant giant squid. At first, the mayor and the city officials thought their problems were over. They caught the beast, but uh, me and my oceanic expert from the mainland, uh, Brett, Cooper, uh, we weren't convinced. It uh, just didn't add up. The next day was the 4th of July, and the beaches were packed with bathers. There was more flesh there than a uh, New Rome Bacchanalia circa 2127. Suddenly there were screams and tentacles the size of a city bus shot out of the water, making grabs for the people on the beach. I shouted quick, to that much bigger boat! and we sallied forth to meet our foe. We were shaken this way and that. It seemed the very sea had come to life as tentacles tried to rip the boat stem to stern. I stood proudly and unwaveringly on the quartermaster's deck, Quarterdeck. rifle in hand, ready to deal the fatal blow to the creature's eye. I can't say if I killed the beast or not, but it went away and probably never came back. At least not here. I, I did hear tell of a, of a similar beast that attacked SeaWorld some 20 years later. Lou Gossett Jr. So now Watch City's Kraken is back, and the robot is a pile of scrap. You're a pile of scrap. And wallows will be repaired! I, I can't leave this up to those guys. This time it's personal. This is Oft Mamer, signing off. Oh, the squid came back the very next day. Yes, the squid came back. He wouldn't stay away. Oh, the squid came back the very next day.